Hello everybody and welcome to my first chess based DVD. For starters I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Jan Gustafsson. I'm German. I live in Hamburg, Germany, where the chess base headquarters are also based, so that's quite convenient. I'm 31 years old. I'm a chess grandmaster. My current feeder rating is 2643. I used to be a member of the German national team. And <clears throat> while I haven't published much on chess, and I've worked a lot as a theoretician. In the past, I have worked as a second for chess stars like Luke van Veli and Peter Leko. And also, I've been an active grandmaster myself. So I feel I know quite a bit about chess openings and want to share some of it, some of it on this DVD. Pretty much all of it, actually, to be honest. My plan is to make two DVDs with a complete black repertoire after E4, E5. So, on this first DVD that you are holding in hands or watching, I'm gonna cover the core of the repertoire, which are the main lines of the Spanish, <clears throat> based on the martial attack. I'm gonna show you the position, which I'm sure you're aware since you bought the DVD. <clears throat> So this is pretty much the starting position of the, of this DVD. We're gonna cover all the lines in the martial in depth and also the anti-martial lines, because sometimes black doesn't allow us to go for it. Then the, on the second DVD, I wanna cover pretty much all other options white has against e4, e5, be it the exchange Spanish, Spanish with d3, the Scotch, the Italian, the four knights. What else is there? The king's gambit. So that in the end, with the two DVDs, I want you to have a complete repertoire for black. Which is not only base, but it's pretty much, it is my own black repertoire. Since this is what I know best and where I have most analysis and what I've worked on most. So I felt it's a good choice. And also, I think in general, E4, E5 is just a good move to play with black. I was playing a lot of lines before that. I played the Karakan, the Nidor, the Paulson, a bunch of Sicilians, even E4, G6. But only when I started playing e4, e5, like in 2003, 2004, I felt like I was onto something good. I could develop the pieces in a normal manner, and I felt it suited me. And I haven't looked back since, and especially the martial. It's always been fun to investigate, and I can recommend it wholeheartedly. As for this DVD, I do hope that everybody who watches it can get something out of it, be it a club player or a top grandmaster. I haven't held anything back and I consider myself a decent specialist on the martial. The problem might be that sometimes I do speak too quickly or I move the piece around too quickly, so in case you won't be able to follow, please don't be too hard on me. But just pause the DVD or watch the video again and I do hope that I lined out the plan so that everybody can follow. The, th the best way to work with it is to also have a look at the, first of all, don't trust me, just check my recommendations, that way you get more out of it. But also to have a look at the analysis file, which is connected to every video, because there the analysis is given in more depth than I can talk about, even though I talk quickly in the video. So make sure that whenever you feel like I didn't cover everything you needed in the video to have a look at the file, and ho I hope it's going to answer your questions. So, thanks a lot for purchasing, and have a lot of fun with the DVD. See you there. Bye-bye.